What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Platinum Walkthrough. Okay, I am just checking for stuff right here. I really am, guys. I'm just poking at... Oh, look at that. There's a stuff right there. There's something right there, yes. Not right there, just a little bit right there. Look at that, we found ourselves a pearl. Anywho, in our last adventure, or our last episode, we actually uh, went through most of 212, Route 212, and we're right here in the Pokemon Mansion. And uh, I'm just here to show you guys a few things that goes on into the Pokemon Mansion, such as the Garden, uh, the Five Turn Challenge, I believe. As you can see, this is the Trophy Garden right here, and you'll be able to find some rare Pokemon. Especially if you uh, install your Pokemon Fire Red, Leaf Green, uh, Sapphire, you know, the, the, the Game Boy Advance games. As you can see, this is a place where you can actually find Pikachu or a Pichu. I believe you can actually find Eevees here too. They're very, very rare. I think they are, yeah. But there's that Pikachu throwing that quick attack thinking that his, uh, yeah. Yeah, he, he, he's thinking that he can defeat my Pokemon right here. He ain't gonna happen. Um... Let's see, what else did I do? What else did I do? No, you know what, that's pretty much what I did. I just battled, defeated everybody, and uh, yeah, this is just an episode showing the Pokemon Mansion right here. Um, uh, Roselia, stop bugging me. Seriously, stop bugging me. Yeah, this is actually, this is actually just the episode just showing you guys uh, what this place is all about. Um, if you guys are looking for Eevees and whatnot, and you want to just keep an Eevee collection, this is the place to go. And then, uh, look at that. We found ourselves a Pichu. That is exactly the Pokemon I'm looking for. No, it is not going to be on my team. It's just, you know, that's another Pokemon I wanted to showcase right here into our, uh, into, uh, into this walk right here. So, I'm just gonna throw a Pokeball. You know, a little Heal Ball. See if it actually capture it. And no! That Pikachu, or that Pichu's uh, being a dick right now. Really, really being a dick. So, um, okay, so here we go. Quick Claw, working for me. And there we go. Return destroys the Pichu, just because, I guess, well, Donatello loves me. He really does. He really, really, really does. So, let's move on right here into the Pokemon Mansion. Or the, uh, I don't even know what it was. I think it is the Pokemon Mansion, or... Yeah, whatever. I may be but uh, I may be screwing it around, but whatever. So let's see. Right here, talking to this lady, talking about Mr. Backlot, the guy, the owner of this place. This is his office. Let's see what he has for us. So this is Mr. Backlot. He's telling us about his Pokemon, gar his trophy garden, and he's actually inviting us to go in there and go capture some of the Pokemon. He's a very, very nice guy. And the butler right here is just like you know, he likes showing off his prized Pokemon, and uh, Manaphy. The extremely rare Pokemon of Sinnoh, which, yeah, you know, in my opinion, it's kind of like a useless rare Pokemon, legendary Pokemon. I don't even know what makes it legendary. So as you can see right here, we get the TM87, which is Swagger. A nice move if you want to, like, you know, confuse your Pokemon opponent. Now this right here, don't know what this door is, yeah, all about. If you guys can comment down below and let me know what that door is, then that'd be great, but... All I know is that it is it, it really nothing. Yeah, and this lady is loafing around. I'm actually going to sleep because, you know what, I feel very, very tired. Actually, I've been very, very tired since uh, day one right here. And uh, look at that. We found ourselves a protein into the trash can. Yes, we are trash digging for that stuff. And uh, let's move on right here. We're going to go into this door and see what we got. We got another lady, and she's like, oh, talking to us about the Pokemon Garden. And she actually gives us the Soothe Bell, which is actually, uh, you know, a nice item to actually uh, get your Pokemon to lo love you just a little bit more. Very, very useful for any Pokemon that evolve through emotion. And here we have a Luxury Ball. It's just a black-looking kind of Pokeball. That's pretty much it. It's very comfortable for Pokemon. Now, here is the, I would like to say, the five-turn challenge. Maybe four, five, eight, ten. I don't even know. Right now, I don't have the firepower for this, so I'm gonna go with Hydra number four. We're gonna be battling this person. Yes, five challenges. We're gonna have to do it five times in a row, or ten times in a row. I can't really remember. You have a set amount of times or turns to actually beat these people. Um, I believe you can't go anything below it because, of course, uh, what was it? Yes, they always do a move. They always do a move where they just like, you know, they, they pause you for one freaking turn, and that's usually, uh, 
That's usually because uh, they use Protect or something like that. Um, as you can see, most of these trainers right here, they will actually have Clefairies. And my problem is that I don't have a Fighting-type Pokemon. I only have these guys right here. I don't... Wait, yeah. I don't have a Fighting-type Pokemon yet. And yes, I know, guys. I know. You guys are commenting down below saying, Draven! Draven, you're forgetting the Dawnstone! Don't worry. I know where it's at. And... Uh, yeah, it's, a, it's moves like this, Endure, that actually makes them last for an extra turn right there. So as you can see, defeated this Clefairy, that is that is a turn right here. But then the next few turns is not going to really turn out to be good because, yeah, they're going to be stronger every single time. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, didn't happen. Yeah, it didn't happen at all. Alrighty. So here we go. Maid Sophie, Sophie coming with her, Cle uh, her Clefairy. And I'm just going to come right here. Ready to kick some butt, intimidating the crud out of you, and uh, well, here we go again. Thunder, and it missed! Oh my god! So as you can see, yeah. <laughs> okay, alrighty, so it puts me to sleep, and as you can see, I already screwed up this whole challenge. I've already uh, wasted two turns right there, so fuck it. I'm just going to be defeating everybody. I believe if you win, you get an item right here. You know what? I'm going to go on to... Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go on to Bulbapedia while this this Clefairy right here is kicking my butt, my butt. And uh, I'm gonna talk to you about what you can actually find or what you can actually get right here. So hold on. Yes, use that move. There's that Endure attack. I'm gonna go to the Pokemon Mansion or Trophy Garden right here. Trophy Garden. Garden. Gardenia. Okay, so here we are, Pokemon Mansion. And, uh, okay, so the Pokemon Mansion is located in the northern half of Route 212, getting my butt kicked by Clefairy right now. It's a big old mansion owned by Mr. Baglot, the owner of the Amity Square. The house is well guarded outside. It is also home to the famous Trophy Garden, which is located in the rear. Okay, so the trainers here, as you, you, you can already see, uh, that's number two. There is a five, uh, if all five maids were defeated in the exact amount request, in the, re well, hold on, wow, 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 defeated in the exact number of requested turns, either Liam or Celeste will appear to battle the player. And, uh, yeah. And usually Liam and, yeah, Liam and Celeste usually have a Blissey, a level 35. That's a good challenge, very, very good challenge and all that stuff. And then, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's that's pretty much what happens right here in this uh, in this whole thing. Um, as you can see, I'm well beyond the whole turns list right here. I think it was like maybe 10 turns, and I'm doing this in like 15. Yeah, 15 turns. Jesus, criminy. Damn. All right, and uh, let's see. Okay, so I got everything that I could uh, actually find here, and. Yeah, the items that I can find, you know, the TM87, um, the Luxury Ball, um, um, the Soothe Bell, and um, um, the Protein. Yeah, that's right, guys. I found all of them. So, yeah, this is a, this is just another place where you can actually battle and gain experience points, you know. Test your skills, you know, just like in Mortal Kombat. And uh, look at that. Hydra number four grows to level 34. How fitting. How very, very fitting. Alrighty, okay. And uh, you know what? There's really nothing to these doors. Huh. Okay, so I guess I answered my own question right there. So here we go. Maid Elena wants the battle, and uh, she's coming out with her Clefairy level 31. No items on her. And, uh, well, let's see. I'm just going to intimidate her. And then, uh, you know what? Screw it. Let's go with the Thunder. That's right. Bye bye Clefairy. Oh, crud. Okay, well, it didn't go away, but it, get, it got paralyzed. You know, that's usually what usually happened to me. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, there's that drain bunch that we don't like. And, uh, okay, so let's go with, uh, you know what? Let's go with another Dragon Rage. See if this wins right here. And, uh, would you look at that. Nearly faints. This Clefairy will not go down. Jesus, criminy. Okay, so I'm confused now. Okay, well, this is gonna be bad. Alright, so let's go with a Bite Attack. Hopefully it does it. And yes, it does. Hell yes. Okay, alrighty. So there you go. None of that. And, uh, well, that's one more. That's four down. One more to go. And, of course, I'm already past the, the turns and stuff. So, yeah, my bad. 
my freaking bad. So, we're already at nine turns, <laughs> and we're like at 14, so, yeah, not the best kind of a showing right now. So, Maid Claire coming out, and she's coming out with a Clefairy yet again, and uh, here we go. Intimidating, that's right. And, uh, well, let's see, uh, you know what? Bite attack, let's see if this works, and uh, that doesn't really sound so good. And, uh, okay, so there's that Meteor Mash that we don't want. Oh my god, oh my god, okay. Let's see. That increases its uh, attack. So, we gotta attack it before it hits me. And as you can see, bam. Say goodbye to Clefairy. That's right. What now? What now? Alrighty. Okay, so that's, uh... Well, that's another victory for us right there. And, uh, of course, we didn't... Yeah, we didn't do it in 9 turns, we did it in 16, yeah, so we don't get anything out of it, we don't even battle anybody new, so we're, we're, we're going to try that again someday soon, with more powerful Pokemon, remember you can do this every single day, anywho, stay tuned guys, in the next episode I will be completing Route 212, see you guys.